Island, a warm welcome to Twickenham, where they haven't beaten England for 16 years. They kick off, playing right to left in this scene. England in white. The Irish have come here this year with the well-earned reputation for playing open rugby of the good old kind spectators despaired of seeing again. Twickenham hasn't long to wait for a demonstration of it. Scrum half Kelly to stand off Mike Gibson, who makes a good pass to Murphy, a try for Ireland. England attack and full-back John Wilcox joins in, all without shaking the Irish defence. Time, Ireland leading 3-0. After the interval, England press hard to wipe out Ireland's narrow advantage. Derek Rogers has the ball. This must be a try. Yes, England equalised. Wilcox adds the goal point. Two points behind now, Ireland seem to redouble their efforts. England are at fault here, and the ball goes to that dangerous centre, Kevin Flynn, not the man to muff a chance like this. Tom Kiernan converts, and Ireland lead again. Nothing like success to inspire the Irish. Watch wing three-quarter Pat Casey, another try. Kiernan converts this one too. The game is all Ireland now. It's Flynn again, scoring their third try this half. And what an afternoon this is for Tom Kiernan, kicking three goals in a row. The best game for many a long day is everybody's verdict when it's all over, with Ireland winning 18-5. Not since 1948 had they beaten England at Twickenham. Talk about a great day for the Irish.